Hey, 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 good morning, everybody. How are you? Don here from Super Blast with another new video for you today. The rig is looking spiffy. Uh, tomorrow, or Thursday rather, we're going to be putting this baby in the action. We got a roof wash, and we also have a tennis court we're going to tackle. Okay, so we'll see how that goes. We're going to do a couple test spots on the tennis court. Um, I cleaned one a long time ago, years ago, and uh, I did it with a surface cleaner because it had a good surface on it. This one's kind of a rubber one, so I don't want to do that. And the last guy that did it left a lot of marks on the court with the surface cleaner, so that's not going to be a good thing. So we need to avoid that, and I think we're going to have to just do a 6% mix and then rinse it 12 gallons the, uh, a minute ball valve, heavy rinse. All right. Today we got a pool cage, uh, five beam pool cage to start the morning off with. And then we have another pool cage after that, a smaller one, a family member. And we'll be knocking that out today. So a little bit about cleaning pool cages today. All right, so let's get after it and get the day started. Hey, 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 here we are at job number one. Hey, look at this here. See this sidewalk up here and these steps? I cleaned those things about five years ago. And they're still clean to this day. That's pretty cool. And I did the driveway too. I was just talking to the lady about it going, wow, I can't believe it stayed this clean that long. She goes, yeah. So I don't know how that works that way. But I mean, those things were black and nasty, green, green, green when I first got here years ago. That's cool to see it that it stayed that good that long, very surprisingly. But the pool cage is not that lucky, all right? So we'll go back there and have a look at it. It's pretty dirty, but we're gonna get after it. All right, let's get after it. All right, let's have a look. It's kind of a unique pool, very dirty. There's stuff everywhere. See these walls and stuff like that. It's pretty unique. I don't think there's another pool like it that I've seen with this wall like this. It's pretty neat. See how moldy the cage is? Lots of mold. She said her son was doing it for a while. He uh, moved back to New York. Poor guy. Why would you want to do that? Create a crowded up there. All right. Well, we're going to set this camera. I think we'll put it over there. And then we're going to get after it. All right. Let's do it. Let's have a look around. We got this place nuked. This is a painted floor, so it's going to be easy to clean up. All the molds dissipated off of here, pretty much. All the screens got sticky, icky, fine in it today. Looks good. All right, now we're going to be uh, getting after the satisfying rooms. Hoo -hoo. Coming out nice.
Let's take a look. Everything looks squeaky, huh? Floor's good. Everything's cleaned up. Bricks look good again. Just went ahead and did the best I could back there. She said not to worry about all that, but, you know, got to rinse it off at least. All right, let's go ahead and hit the outside of this right here. Right there real quick. See that black? Watch it disappear. We'll be right back. All right, it only takes a second. Hey, 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 here we are, job number two. This is a relative's home. It's my cousin, Christine. And if you want really good bar, bar service and you live in Spring Hill and you want good food, go to Rookie Sports Bar. Tell them that Don sent you and go in and say hello to Christine, all right? Tell her I sent you down there, all right? Good food, good service, all right? We're gonna be doing a pool case today. We're gonna run the machine on three quarter speed and we'll see you back there. All right, let's take a look. There used to be a little bar back here. It's gone. Had to clean up a little bit, put everything around. Christine, you never pick stuff up. Need to get after it. Anyway, appreciate the work. Hope you're having fun on your vacation. If you're watching the video today, appreciate the work again. And nothing left to do, but get it cleaned up. Get after it. Let's take a look. Everything's all SH down, everything's cleaned up. All we gotta do now is the satisfying rinse. All right, that's gonna be a wrap, huh? Look at the floors nice and neat and clean again. I mean, you got these rust stains from the um, bench press there, but for the most part, the place is cleaned up. Uh, a coat of paint on this floor would do good. Uh, maybe we can get uh, my cousin's son to do that one of these days. Can get out here with a roller and some good paint. 
get the place looking better. But it's, you know, I mean, it looks good. See? All right, let's get after it. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and do that. And be notified of all the crazy pressure washing stuff that happens here. I always have free class. Try to help you guys out that are just starting out here. All right, I teach the basics. The basics work. So why not go with that, right? All right, I'm Don. And you know what to do, right? Just get after it. And all good things will happen for you. All right, I got me 175 gallons of water in the tank. Now I'm better known as Juan Valdez. <laughs> all right, let's go look at this little porch, all right? Let's get after it. Don here from Super Blast. My whole family gets after it. Even my dog gets after it. Watch this. Hey, Sam, sit down. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Get after it. What do we do, hon? We all get after it. See that? Get after it. Well, guys, thank you for everything. So what do we do? You get after it. We get after it. Do you get after it? Always. What do you do? Get after it. At home, I Everybody gets it. after it. Hey, when he gets home, he gets after it. <laughs> hey, look at this dude up here. I bet he even gets after it. Mr. America. Get after it!